Welcome back, everyone. I'm Doug Reardon. And I'm Janice Allen, a fourth grader in Battle Creek, inspiring other kids to read during the pandemic. It's a great way to kill time. Keeps your mind sharp, too. Right. But she's been reading children's book, uh, books and then posting them on her YouTube channel. And now she's challenging her friends to do the same. Our Lauren Edwards joins us live after talking to her and her family at their house in Battle Creek. Lauren. Doug and Janice, talk about doing something good. We met Savannah earlier today, and she is a stellar kid. She's good in school. She gets good grades. She's very active in her school, doing a ton of activities, and she just loves to read, though. Her passion is reading uh, Stephen King books, which is phenomenal, because I definitely was not reading that at 10 years old, but it's what she loves to do. And right now, she's just focused on helping others, especially those younger than her, fall in love with reading as well. Hi, boys and girls, and welcome back to Reading with Savannah. I've been reading books to little kids so they could focus on the good in the world and not the negativity. Would you like a donut? Fourth grader Savannah Feltner, determined to make children smile and learn while they're at home keeping safe from the coronavirus. I've been reading, like, K through third grade books so that little kids, I'm targeting younger kids as my audience. The kids at her school, Kellogg Elementary, Savannah says, her parents have been recording her reading and then posting them on her YouTube channel, Reading with Savannah. I'm asking them questions so they could, like, think a little bit. And I'm also engaging with the audience, too. Please, Mr. Panda. Savannah's loving it. And she says she was inspired by her teacher, Amanda Bryant, who's been posting videos as well. My name is Judy B. Jones. I started doing some Junie B. Jones readings and posting some challenges at the end just for them to, because our principal always says, make sure the reading has a purpose. Hi, Duncan. Savannah took that literally and is now challenging her peers to do the same. Your teacher can sit there and read you a book, but when you see your peer doing it, it's a lot more motivating. And when they call you out and they're like, hey, challenge for you, now you do it. I was like, yes, Savannah, like, you go, girl. He has a little smiley face. Bryant couldn't be prouder, but Savannah's just focused on reading and spreading some goodwill. I'm going to post a video every single day until this pandemic is done and so that everybody has a little bit of kindness. Bye, guys. How sweet and endearing is that? She has just a positive attitude, and she's spending her days just doing something good. And when I asked her, you know, does she miss school? She said, absolutely. She misses her friends, but it gives her more time to read. And now she's just reading to children and um, posting all those videos on her YouTube channel. Reporting live here in Battle Creek, Lauren Edwards, Fox 17 News. Yeah, it's great. Uh, kids are going to have to find ways, parents too, to, to keep their minds sharp. She's going to read a lot of books, and I admire yeah. her tenacity to get through this. No kidding. Maybe we'll tune in one day. Yeah. Here's some old stories mm -hmm. we haven't heard in a while.